happy Thursday. Well, we've got some trained alpacas who love to party on the show today. And well, hold on, wait a second. I know that. I know that last party animal. I know that last party animal. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> which one yeah, here does one belong? <laughs> well, Fiona, did you know that actually alpacas were domesticated by the Incas more than six thousand years ago, and they were used more for nobility. And you were domesticated by Mallory, what, two years ago when you got married? Two years ago. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, happy Thursday, everybody. I'm Fiona Gorostiza. And I'm David Elder, filling mm -hmm. in for Mike Osterhage. And, you know, we have such a great show ahead of us today. And we're actually going to be starting it out with some furry friends. Right? Oh, yes. And you saw them right there. And Loretta Hayevsky, who calls herself tech expert in organizing alpaca hugs, is here, of course, with your sweet babies. And we want to meet each one of them right now, starting with the one that David is petting. Okay, so right here, <laughs> right here we have Willie. Uh, Willie is, uh, he's pretty much the pasture king of the herd. Um, <laughs> he has his name, of course, because his long hair on his ears, uh, similar to Willie Nelson. Mm. That's how he got the name. <laughs> okay. Uh, the next one over here we have is Houston. He's our terrible two-year-old. He's very, very sweet and curious. A little bit training to do, but he's on his way. Here on the end, we have Waylon, and Waylon is Mr. Personality. He loves cameras. He loves them in his face. He's very sweet. You can hug him, take pictures with him, and literally sit right next to him and have a little emotional support. Now, you mentioned Waylon was, is two. Does he go through any sort of terrible twos? <laughs> well, Houston is two. He, um, he does throw terrible two temper oh. tantrums periodically. Okay. Uh, usually, it's when I'm training him. He... Uh, doesn't want to walk, so he body slams himself to the ground, just like a terrible two-year-old during a temper tantrum. Oh my That's God. what Houston will do. Now, outside of the temper tra uh, tantrums, you can actually have them at events and things like that. So what kind of events have they been to? Absolutely. They've been to lots of weddings. They've been to lots of Fiesta Cinco de Mayo parties. We are actually here in um, one of the large resorts in San Antonio several times a month. Uh, usually for big corporate events, and um, so they will go dress similar to what they're wearing, sometimes with beer packs. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So they have costume changes. They do have costume <laughs> changes, and lots and lots of them. Now, how much uh, fleece, you know, per year do they grow and are sheared off? So it's probably about 8 to 11 inches long when it's sheared. Uh, they get one full body shearing a year. We do not do that. We hire a company to do that. They can do it in about 15 minutes. They're professionals. And now when it comes to the actual fleece, uh, is it true that they're actually water resistant and flame resistant? They are water resistant, flame resistant. Um, they also produce no lanolin in their fleece. So people with allergies really like to have 100% uh, alpaca made products, scarves and hats and things like that. Now, do they make any sounds? They we do were... make some sounds. They make I just a... heard it. <laughs> oh, did you? I just heard it. They make a similar to a humming sound, and each one has a different pitch, just like we have a different pitch. Um, and these guys, their pitch, we can know they're our baby, so we know who's talking. They do that all day long. It's just communication between the herd. And now when it comes to their actual colors, we're looking at, I mean, they have like a gorgeous cream color, but you said they come in lots of colors. They actually come in 22 different shades, from the very darkest midnight black to the very whitest cotton ball white, that, oh. and all the shades in between. That's so cute. <laughs> and they're so soft. They're extremely soft. So alpaca fleece is one of the strongest and as well as the softest um, natural fibers. And wow. you know, uh, we're petting them here, and they're very calm. Are they like some people think of them almost as therapy dogs. Is that something that they're commonly like re referenced to? Or? So I actually just do. I don't necessarily call it a therapy program, it's more of a happiness program <laughs> because you get to interact one-on-one -on -one with them, so they... <laughs> I think, hey, I, think he's he's I, I think yeah. I think he only he arranged for out. the first five minutes to be paid by his agent, yeah. <laughs> and he's done. He's so out. he yeah. is two years old, oh. so you know it. Maybe it's nap time yeah. for him. <laughs> well, so taking care of these guys day to day, are, 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 can they be potty trained? Are they so actually, these guys are potty trained. When Ooh. we go to an event, it takes a while to get it done, just like you uh, house train your pets. Mm -hmm. um, we do, we spend the same amount of time with them. Um, when they get to an event, they can basically to go to the bathroom on command. Wow. We, well, <laughs> Very interesting. Yeah. We bring a little Ziploc bag what? with their stuff in it, and we put it where we want them to go, and we bring it to them, they smell it, and they go to the bathroom. Very trained. Now, if people want them for at their next parties or events, they're, they're so cute. Uh, how do they do that? So they can actually look me up on Facebook. 
They can look me up on Instagram, Twitter. Um, my uh, website is texaspartyanimals.com. Okay, and not only the alpacas, but there are alpaca cookies, right? Not made from alpacas. <laughs> no, these alpaca cookies are not made from alpacas. I have actually partnered with um, Carrie Michael, um, and she has Carrie's cookies out of Lagrange. She. Um, she and I have a partnership now, and we are adding her custom cookies to our owl packages. So it's an upgrade to your regular owl package, and you can have those along with the alpacas at your event. Well, that's fantastic. So if you want to get uh, uh, the cookies, you want to get the alpacas at your events, this is actually, I mean, look at this right here. This is some of the events that they've been to, the weddings like you had mentioned earlier. And they're absolutely just cute and gorgeous, and I would love to have them just here all day. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you so much. And, of course, we get to watch for you in an upcoming edition of Women's World Magazine, right? Absolutely. Women's World Magazine is uh, going to be hitting the shelves on uh, August 20, um, excuse me, September 26th, mm -hmm. and the edition will be a two-page spread in Women's World Magazine. Well, congratulations. Thank you so much. And Thanks for more so information for on us. Texas Party Animals, just head to essaylive.com and click on the As Seen on Essay Live tab.